Hi, boys and girls. It's Miss Linda. I'm coming to you today to read you a book. It's called Pete the Cat. I love my white shoes. Here's all his shoes hanging. And this reads again, Pete the Cat. I love my white shoes. Pete the Cat was walking down the street in his brand new white shoes. Pete loved his white shoes so much, he sang this song. I love my white shoes, I love my white shoes, I love my white shoes. Oh no! Pete stepped in a large pile of strawberries. What color did it turn his shoes? If you said red, you were right. Pete did cry. Goodness, no. He kept walking along and singing his song. Everything is cool. I love my red shoes. I love my red shoes. I love my red shoes. So he sang that song again. Oh no, Pete stepped in a large pile of blueberries. What color did it turn his shoes? Do you know what color? What color are blueberries? Blue. Did Pete cry? Goodness no, he kept walking along and singing his song. Awesome, he says. I love my blue shoes. I love my blue shoes. I love my blue shoes. Oh, no. Pete stepped in a large puddle of mud. What color did it turn his shoes? What color is mud? Sometimes it's black. And sometimes it's, you said brown, you were right. Did Pete cry? Goodness, no. He kept walking along and singing his song, Groovy. I love my brown shoes. I love my brown shoes. I love my brown shoes. Oh, no. Pete stepped in a bucket of water. And all the brown and all the blue and all the red were washed away. What color were his shoes again? White. But now they were wet. Did Pete cry? Goodness, no. He kept walking along and singing his song, Rock and Roll. I love my wet shoes. I love my wet shoes. I love my wet shoes. The moral of Pete's story is no matter what you step in, keep walking along and singing your song. If you notice, he's got each color shoe on each of his feet. Because it's all good. The end. Okay, boys and girls, it was good reading of this book. It's Friday now, so we will have a, I hope you have a good weekend, and I will see you on Monday. Bye.